Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If you want to see how I achieve this eye look for a simple fall eye look, then just keep on watching. So first thing I did, I went in with the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Portion, which this primer portion is good, amazing. One of the best ones that i found. I like to use it just a little bit and I just apply it with my finger and go over my lid. Now I want to go in with the Coffee Shop Palette from what is this, Juvia's Place and I'm going to go into this dark shadow, this dark shadow right here and put this on my lid. Now we're going to the Warrior 2 palette from Juvia's Place and I'm going to use Zama, which is this orange shade right here. Now I'm going to go in with the Huda Huda The Huda Beauty Topaz Deception Palette. I don't think they make these no more, but I got hands on one. And I'm going to take this little yellow orange shade right here and blend out the top of it. Now I'm just keep going back in, back and forth till I get the shades blended out how I want them to be blended out. Now I'm going to go in with my Sephora Cole eyeliner pencil and I'm going to push my lid back. Going with my next, that's a point. And we're going to put on this wing. Now I'm going to go in with my EXA 1018 mascara and we're going to coat these eyelashes. Now I need to do my eyebrows and for my eyebrows I'm using this Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil in the shade, what is this shade? Brown Black and it's the number 5. So I'm going to use this to do my eyebrows. Now I'm going to 
Now I need to clean up my eyebrows with the Born This Way, what is this called? Multi Sculpting Concealer. Now that this is all done, let's go ahead and get the rest of my face done. First thing first, I ain't did my eyelashes. Now let's go in and prime my face. I'm using the, what is this called? The Milk Hydro Primer. I love this stuff. I still don't know to this day why I have not purchased this sooner. And I've already moisturize my face now I'm gonna let this dry down for a minute till it gets a little bit tacky I'm gonna go in with my exa color corrector in the shade red orange Now that this dried down a little bit, I'm gonna go in and just blend this out. Now for foundation today, I'm going in with my Maybelline Tattoo Studio Fit Me in the shade 355 in Coconut. Now I'm going to go over with my sponge and this one's from Do Color. Very good sponge. And I'm just going to go over everywhere that I put foundation and just blend it out. Then I'm going to go back in with my Too Faced Concealer and conceal my under eyes.
Now while this is drying down, I'm going to go in with my NARS Laguna Bronzer in the shade number four. Now, my concealer should be dried down just enough, but if it's dried down too much, I like this to go in with my Glow Fix. It looks still a little wet right now, but I'll go in with my Glow Fix for Makeup Revolution just to wet down my face. Now, if you want to go for a little bit more brightness like I do, I'm going in with my one size. And I'm just going to let it dry down just a little bit. Now I'm going to go in and set my under eyes with my Fenty Beauty, what is this called? Setting powder in the shade Honey. So now that I'm powdered down my face with everywhere else that I need powder, I'm going to go in with my Huda Kula Caramel from Benefit. Is this Benefit? Yeah, from Benefit. And we're just going to warm back up my face just a little bit more. 
I got brushes everywhere. I didn't have brushes for one minute, and now I got lots of brushes. Now I'm going to take a big brush and get off any excess powder that I got left all over my face. Not, but now I need to go back in and chisel out my nose. The girl want to cut nose. Not that. Now for blush today, I'm going in with my one size rich bitch. What is this called? Blush and it's a three, three pan brush. It's got a cream, it's got a blush and a highlighter. So I'll mix these two together to give me the shade that I want. So I might, I got a little too much blush over in the middle of my face. I'm going go with my, the back of my sponge. And I'll go with this. Now I'm gonna go in with the foundation and I'm going in, well foundation powder. I'm going in with dark one, golden. I'm actually a neutral kind of girl, but most of Patrick Star stuff is a a little bit on the golden side, but it's all right. And I'm gonna take my puff and just set it where else and set where I just apply the sponge. Now I'm gonna go in and spray down my face with the Morphe Mattifying Continuous Sentence Mist. And while that's drying down, I'm going to go in and do my lips.
Okay guys, so what do you think of the final result? I went back in, put on some mascara that I forgot to put on, and I smoked out my bottom lash line. But if you like this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And keep on coming back to my channel for more content and see what other fall videos that I drop this year. Bye guys.